Hey everybody, this is Rolling Through Life. My name is Wanda, and today I'm doing a Flash My Stash video. And the first stash I want to show you is this. I'm lucky because the roads look pretty clear today, so I can go out. So, let's head in and let me show you my other stash. Okay, so today I thought I would show you my yarn stash. Um, I have built it up pretty good, but you know us crocheters, we still need more. And I will show you the spot where I have space for more. Okay, here's my real stash. I turned my pantry into a yarn closet. Um, down here I have Red Heart Super Saver. Um, now all this yarn, and right here is Red Heart, um, this is all projects I have to do. Every one of these skeins are earmarked. Um, this here is my um, Red Heart with Love. Now all these did was earmarked, but I was going to do a unicorn blanket with this, this, and this one. And the person I was going to make it for left from YouTube, so she doesn't need a baby blanket. So I have those there. I don't know what I'll do with them, but they're there if I need them. Um, I have tan and turquoise and white, dark blue, and a kind of like a um, country blue. Those are all ear earmarked for Afghans also. So, that is my With Love. Now, up here, I have different brands. I have, um, this is Lion Brand Homestead USA. Um, it's that bulky stuff I just bought a couple weeks ago. It's black and white. I'm going to make a sweater with that. These are the Premier Sweet Rolls. Um, each one's a different color. Not sure what I'm going to do with those yet, but... I like having them there. This is um, Vanish Choice Lion Brand. This is the color um, Taupe Mist. This is what I made my um, son's uh, scarf for him, and he loves that. And actually, after you wash this, this is so soft. Um, this is, I believe, Lion Brand Ice Cream. It's in um, shades of purple. I'm sorry about the camera. I just uh, I tried to put it on the tripod and I couldn't get the angles I wanted. But this is from Hershner. It's Afghan yarn. It's a two ply yarn, real soft. Have that in um, four different shades of blue that was gifted to me. And then I have um, the big twist sincerely. And this is. Deborah Nerville um, in Serenity. I um I get one less skein in this pile because I'm making a hat with that. And I got some fun fur. And then this one I was gonna make a show out of. It's the baby or Bernat baby coordinates. It's a nice silver. And then these are uh, big twists. I have one in dusty blue and then two in purple. So that's the different yarns I have. Now up here is my Karen. That's my pride and joy. I love Karen's Simply Soft. And those are for a major project I'm working on. So I love that. I love it. I don't know. I, I just can't stop looking at it. It's so pretty. And then I had three more skeins up there of uh, Karen's Simply Soft. My goal for next year is to have at least four high all the way across on that shelf. And then I will be happy. But on that shelf, I kind of want different textures, different brands, you know, thing I can, things I can... Um, experiment with if I find patterns to go with the um, type of yarn but yeah 
So that's my X pantry to my yarn storage. What I want to do is get another bin like this and put my overflow of um, Karen Simply Soft down there. But for now, it's okay. So let me go in the other room and show you a tote that I have. Okay, this is my tote of cotton yarn. As you can see, I have every color imaginable in here. Um, I used to do towels a lot, like the toppers of towels, but they're just not doing so well. So what I'm going to do with these is I'm going to crochet up some um, face cloths. And my daughter, she sells um, Perfectly Posh. And she's going to offer to her clients um, face towels. She's going to sell it through a Perfectly Posh. So, that is all my cotton yarn. So that will be gone soon. I'm not replacing any of that. Unless it take you know it takes off with her her um her business so that's the only way I'll buy more but yeah so that's my stash um I don't know I love the feel of yarn the look of yarn it's it's a better feel of any craft I've ever done so um I hope you enjoyed it um and, you know, if you have any favorite brands out there or um, maybe a texture or something, um, yeah, leave a comment below. Let me tell or let me know what's one of your favorites and maybe something I could make with it. Um, but that's all I have for now. I'm going to start planning. Yeah. So I will talk to you all later. Bye.